What's up everybody, welcome to the channel. Now in this video we're gonna be doing something really cool. What we're gonna be doing is taking a rubber ducky and we're gonna be grabbing passwords off of Windows 10 and 11 PCs. The whole process is super easy. If you've seen my previous video, basically we're gonna be building on top of that because in the previous videos, uh, or the video I should say, we built uh, a rubber ducky using a WaveShare RP2040 Zero. So, uh, if you haven't seen it, I strongly recommend that you see it before this one. It's a five minute video, easy peasy, quick. But we're gonna be building off of that, or if you're familiar with the rubber ducky, you may not need to see it anyway, cause you're gonna be familiar with what's gonna be happening. So, in this video, like I said, um, we're gonna be walking you through on how to add a payload to your rubber ducky that once plugged into a Windows 10 or Windows 11 PC. It's gonna grab all the Wi-Fi passwords that are stored. It's gonna shoot it to an Outlook uh, email for you. And that's it, that's that. So uh, a lot of it is copy and paste. Now I do have to give a shout out to Hack5 because I did use their script. However, I did make minor modifications because every time I ran it, it gave me errors. So. Uh, yeah, uh, I strongly recommend that you use my script because I tested it on Windows 10, Windows 11, works like a charm, and 20 seconds, 25 seconds later, you're in, you're out. It's simple, it's fun, and devilishly cool. All right, so let's get into it. <laughs> All right, everybody, let's get into it. First, you're gonna to wanna to navigate to the ducky and go to the root folder. Over there, you're gonna have the payload.dd. Start off with a blank payload. Then navigate to my GitHub repository with the link below the video. You will see two files, readme and the script. In the readme, it's a good reference for you to go back to it because this is where all the information on how to do this. We're gonna walk you through it in this video, so let's go ahead and do that. Go back and hit the script, and over here you either highlight everything or hit Control A, which highlights everything, then copy it, then navigate back to the DD, and paste everything. So there will be four fields that you will need to modify based on your email and password, but first let's give credit to Hack5. This is their script. I just made some modifications to it because I ran into some errors running it as is. So as mentioned, this this script works on Windows 10 and 11. Let's go ahead and note that over here. It is also noted on my GitHub. So uh, shout out to Hack5. Now we're gonna scroll down to line 67 or might be 68 in your case. And you're gonna wanna change this criteria which should say enter your email here, enter your password here. Put in your Outlook email, your Outlook password, then skip a line, go down, put your email address as well then skip another line and put your email address as well. It's going to note where you need to put your own information as such over here. Enter your email, enter your password, enter your email, enter your email. So once you've gone ahead and made those changes in the payload, go ahead and save it. Once you save it, you're going to need to unplug and replug your ducky. Once you do that, it'll go ahead and run the script as you will see right now. So the first thing it's going to do, it's going to open up a command prompt. It's going to start running the commands that are in the script. Then it's going to open a PowerShell and it's going to continue. Basically what it's going to be doing is creating files, opening the file that has all the passwords, pasting it into the file, emailing it to your credentials, and then it will delete all those files that it created. Not the ones that exist on your PC, but the ones that created uh, that end with a .txt. And that's it, it's gonna delete everything, no mess, nothing left behind, and you're good to go. So now once you've done that, the script runs, no issues, go back to your email, and you will have an email that has the SSIDs and the corresponding passwords with it. You can uh, scroll up and down depending on how many you have, but anything that you have saved on that desktop, that PC will be shown in your email over here as such. There you go. It was that easy. So plug it in, take it out a few seconds later, and you have retrieved your passwords, your friends' passwords that may have forgotten their Wi-Fi, etc. 
but it was that quick, that easy. And you know what? I really appreciate you guys watching the video. I hope that you stick around because there's going to be some more cool videos coming up on how to run some more scripts that do more cool stuff. And I guarantee you that you are going to love it. So stick around, subscribe, hit the like button, hit share, all that good stuff. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.